right now, 755 AM East Coast time. And we're going to show you something. If you have not seen Green Pan yet, this is the new evolution of cookware that is changing everything. We want nonstick. We love that easy release. We love the easy cleanup that comes from nonstick cookware. But in the past, it took chemical agents like PFOA and PTFE to be able to make those nonstick surfaces come to life. Green Pan has been around since 2007. They changed the entire marketplace with a unique patented ceramic coating that doesn't flake off into your food. You're not ordering your fried chicken with a side of polytetrafluoroethylene anymore. And we've got colors like you have never seen. This is one of the biggest sets we have ever offered from Green Pan. A lot of these colors are exclusive to QVC. We have the new turquoise and our special guest, I think has an affinity for this particular color. We then have a gorgeous burgundy red down at the bottom. Oh, you wanna start at the top? We've got the eggplant, which is QVC exclusive and brand new. We've got that brand new green color, which is QVC exclusive and new. We have a blue, a black, and then also a burgundy red. This is a big 11 piece set with a seven and an 11 inch skillet. You get a four quart covered saucepan with a lid you get a great steamer insert, which is rare. We don't normally do that in the bigger saute pan. And then we're also going to give you a huge six quart Dutch oven. Do you know who uses this cookware? She uses it on her show that you're gonna find on the Food Network. She uses it at home as well. I wanna introduce you to Trisha Yearwood. How are you? Hello, I'm good, how are you? It's so nice to have you here. <laughs> Thank you, good to be here. Every, everybody who said who has worked with you is that you're so nice, and I was nervous <laughs> about meeting you. Oh, please. Because I don't meet country stars you're very often. You're the nicest guy ever. I'm just, I'm just over here swirling my egg, that's what I'm doing. Well, you, you were cooking just about the same time that you started singing, Little Girl in Georgia. True, my mom was a great cook and my and my dad too. And so I just grew up with, we had a meal on the table every night, home cooked meal every night. And it's Southern cooking. It is Southern cooking. Which is cooking. what your show on the Food Network is all about. It is. Uh, this is such a different type of cookware. Look at the release, which means things don't burn. You've got control. Cleanup is easier than ever before. And I love, by the way, nothing like a big fat steak. I know, here I'm gonna flip that steak At 7.55 in the morning. <laughs> The breakfast steak. So, this is actually a, a pan with with marks uh, raised ribs on it, so that you can actually sear and brown. Ooh. You can cook at a high temperature. That's what we're showing here. Um, most nonstick pans only um, at 500 degrees they break down, and this stovetop's already over 500 degrees. Uh, so when you say break down, then if you get to those temperatures, those polytetrafluoroethylenes can leach into your food. These are safe to up to eight. Hundred degrees. Yeah, and and you know, Green Pan was the first that guys to do this. They yes. patented this technology, and before that, we all had those nonstick pans. It's the best thing we had. Yes. But now that we have this, it's um, it's ceramic, and it's beautiful. And the ceramic is actually on the inside and the outside of the pan, so it's very durable. Um, but you can actually, so you can cook at a higher temperature. If you want to sear something and cook it really fast or get those sear marks, you got to have high heat, and, and, and you don't and have to worry what, about this being in your that's food what or being locks in the air. In the flavor. That's when yeah, a steak so becomes really. Doing. Now, by the way, these will all go in the oven too. They'll all uh, go in the now, oven. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually put this in the oven. I'm gonna top this with a little bit of red sauce and some on cheese on top of a steak. On top of a steak. I like the way you say. <laughs> and then, um, and then I'm gonna put this in the oven. So I'm gonna put some cheese on top. Okay. And here's the cool thing about this, Dan. <laughs> this lid that is on this big four quart uh -huh. actually fits also on here. So you got a lid Beautiful. that works for both things. And then I'm gonna actually stick this in the oven. This goes up to 300 degrees. Okay. 350 degrees, sorry. 350, I'm just gonna get my cheese melted in there. Now, I mean, And I've got something in the oven already because I was up early cooking for you this morning. Did you really? <gasps> so this is a frittata. And by the way, there's something else in that oven too that I've never seen before. Yeah, we'll get that out in a minute. This is beautiful. <laughs> so you're, this you're is a, a frittata. You're a celebrity. People know you from, what, over 15 million albums. I've done sold. okay. <laughs> you've done you've done all right uh, but you know we think of celebrities as having gourmet chefs at home you cook for you and your husband I do I cook cooks. I do I cook and um, I, I it's something that makes me relax I enjoy doing it I've okay. done it my whole life um, I'm gonna just look show you this. this yeah this is this is the only way I'll eat spinach yeah, and this is now look how clean that comes out of that pan right there's virtually no cleanup at now, all here's the cleanup the cleanup's really difficult watch this okay 
No need to involve the butler. Now it's done. We can do this. <laughs> we can totally do this. And you know, I, I really do love these pans. I've always been a non-stick girl. That's what my mom always used. Okay. And again, my, but my mom's non-stick broke down over time and it actually doesn't really, isn't really non-stick anymore because right. everything starts little to stick flakes. to the pan, little flakes. And you think about that's in your food and you're eating that and it's kind of scary. Well, let's tell them the story because on her show that she's had now, how many seasons now? We're on season six right now. We're season filming six. season six, yeah. This is beautiful. Uh, it was by her choice that she started using these pans. You yes. could have picked anyone, any brand name, but you chose these. I, I mean, I really do use them. I love them. I, uh -huh. The first gr the first one that I used was actually this small pan. My mom had this pan, All right. and, sh and she was actually battling cancer, and she was trying to eat healthier, and so she wanted to use a pan that she didn't have to put a lot of oil, a lot of butter in. Uh -huh. And I just fell in love with a pan. And so I bought one for my sister. I think my sister's watching this morning. She's on the show a lot. Uh, hi, hi, Beth. And, um, but now I'm going to show you something that's really cool because right. you know how cheese is gross in a pan. Cheese is hard to clean in a pan. See, I like. The First way of all, you're going to love the fact that there's cheese on the outside of your grilled cheese and on the inside uh, of your uh, grilled cheese. I had asked the first question I asked when Trisha came out here on the set. Uh, do we have any tofu out here at all? <laughs> any? Not. We don't. We don't. We do have. We do have sloppy joes here. Okay. Um, and this is the thing about this is that this will feed your whole family. That's that smells a huge, so good. Huge four quart pan, and you can put. I usually I, I make my tomato sauce in it for my spaghetti. Okay. I make soup in it. Um, I mean, you, it's huge. These, these are wonderful. Stay cool handles. I mean, you can see it bubbling up. Yeah. But everything about this pan. The first time you use a green pan. And look how it's not sticking. You realize you've got something that's extraordinary. Yeah, it's and true. It, and it's cookware for a lifetime. Uh, I, I hate to put it this way, but at 140 bucks, there's a lot of aluminum throwaway cookware. Right, right. But you spend harder money, you're going to use it for a couple of seasons, and then you have no choice. You've got to throw it away. This is built to last a lifetime. And I'm not a chef. I'm a home cook. Oh, and so I'll, I'll tell you what. So you I know like. How to so do I just like right. practical, and I like easy to clean up. It goes in the dishwasher. Okay. I'm not going to use a pan that I can put in the dishwasher because I've just got time. But you saw how easy that was to clean out. So you don't even have to. You can just wipe it right out, and you're look, done. Look how even that heating. Did you just do a grilled cheese sandwich with bacon and cheese on the outside? I did. And watch this. Okay. So all this cheese is in this pan. Oh. Cheese is hard to clean out of a pan. So check this out. I, I'm licking so, that out. <laughs> so, so now my grilled cheese is done. Now, 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 hold Oops. that so they can see. It. My pan. And look at this. Look at the cheese. Now watch the cheese slide. is just sliding off the pan. Now I'm gonna add. I'm gonna not lose any cheese. We don't want to lose any no. cheese. That would be wasteful. But then I'm gonna wipe this pan out, and you're gonna see again. Now that's got cooked cheese in the bottom of it. Okay. And it's just gonna wipe right out. And I, for so much, so much cookware. And I've been here for 26 years, and I remember when nonstick was first invented. There were so many gimmicks to it. There is no gimmick in these pans. It's high grade, thick aluminum. They put a nice big fat bottom on it. This is ceramic on the outside, patented ceramic on the inside. This brand new color, that eggplant, you can't get anywhere else. The new green, exclusive to QVC for a limited time. We have blue, we have black, and then we have a gorgeous burgundy red. And the, the pans are also included. You just painted your kitchen in this color, I didn't did. You? I just painted my wall that color. I really do love the turquoise. This has been one of the most popular colors. I think people are ready for springtime to update their cookware as well. You're going to get a 7-inch skillet. You get an 11-inch skillet, a big 4-quart covered saucepan. You get a one quart saucepan and then three quart. Now the three quart also gives you, and we don't often do this, that's the steamer insert. And that steamer insert's been a little difficult to find, but we've got it. And then we also give you the huge six quart Dutch oven, which you're doing, what are you doing in the six quart? This is kale soup. Now I know that you're not a veggie guy, but there kale is, soup. there's kale soup. So kale is really good for you, but I've disguised it with some chorizo. It's got a nice spicy okay. flavor to it. And you, you we're gonna add a little soup extra for kale. For your husband? Yeah, but he doesn't know that there's kale in it. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is, women, you understand. You gotta sneak this stuff I'm just, by yeah, us. I'm just, I'm just putting a little bit extra in there, just sneaking it in there. Let me show you this. This See, is when I, I go like this. Because I can't see Garth Brooks coming home going, you know, I'm really looking forward to kale. <laughs> he doesn't. He just, he just loves my cooking. All right, check this out. This is Boston cream pie. You're into that, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is chocolate sauce. <gasps> Which would stick Which like would a nightmare. Which would totally stick. But I'm gonna show you. We're gonna. Oh, pour it all out. Trisha, that smells really good. <laughs> I know good. it does smell really good. This is just ganache oh and easy the ganache. There's a whole lot of it. I'm just going to go all over that. Everything cake. that you do on your show is about ease of yeah, making your family exactly. smile. Exactly. That's one of the reasons that I really do love these pans. I'm not, I don't like, I don't, 
promote anything that I don't really believe in. Yep. And I use these pans and I love them. Look at this. Okay, so there's a little chocolate left in the bottom, but we're just gonna wipe it right out. Now, okay, change for the sake of change is not a good thing. Right. Uh, the old non-sticks, like the polytetrafluoroethylene, in its day they were good. It's all we had. This is change for the better. This is a better nonstick service. It surface. is a better nonstick service. And this particular little little saucepan has a pouring rim, so that whole rim around the edge, That's nice. you can pour out of any side of it and it's easy to pour and, and just easy to clean. I mean, you can put this in the dishwasher, like I said, but um, you don't have to. You can rinse it out, you can just wipe it out with a wet cloth and you're good to go. Take, take me through, through the magic of culinary skills and your show. Take me to your little hometown in Georgia okay. and show them what you've got Oh, okay. In a fry pan. I've never seen this done in a fry pan before. My, I have a little friend named Mrs. Helen Carter. Okay. And she makes a skillet apple pie. So it's it's all goes directly in a skillet. It's super easy to make. That's and what's really cool about this beautiful. is that, let me put it out here. It's, okay. What's really nice about this too is okay. that it, um, you could put this on the table and serve it that way and it's really pretty. Right, right out of the fry right pan. Right out of the fry pan. Pick your favorite I color and then just that. serve it right up. We got sloppy joes going. This really just shows the capacity. This will feed your whole family. Yep. And cooking should be fun. Absolutely. It, it should not have to be drudgery. Uh, you are probably one of the busiest women in the world. Well, uh, I'm, I mean, I keep pretty busy. Are you on tour right now? <laughs> I'm on tour. Car? Yes, I'm okay. on tour. So, but you still want to feed your family. You love the smiles that come from, from making people happy. Yeah, and, and I. That's and, what this will do. I give this as gifts. This is what I give to, like, if I was getting married, okay. I give it for Christmas gifts because I believe in it. I know they're going to love it. Yep. And, and I haven't had a complaint yet. Everybody's like, I love those pans. They like that they work great, how easy they are to clean up, and that they stay really pretty. That ceramic nonstick on the inside and the outside is yep. going to keep them these colors and keep for them years. really pretty. Yeah. Uh, people are dying to talk to you. We, we want to say hello to Lisa out in California. Lisa, say hello to our special guest. Hi, Lisa. Good morning, Trisha and Dan. Oh, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good. I'm very excited about these pots and pans. That's, have you picked a favorite color yet? Yes, the burgundy. Okay. Oh, nice, very nice. Classy choice, we got them all over the uh, stuff top here. And what do you like about what we've talked about? Well, we've been using some pans that have Teflon, and uh, it's time to get rid of those. My yep. son started cooking his own meals, and he's been using metal, and I keep telling him not to. So I'm just going <laughs> to get rid of all those and use these. That's, that's wonderful. I have to tell you that this is also true. I, the first, I'm a home cook. I'm not a chef. So I thought I needed to buy the really big expensive pan that is, you know, stainless on the inside. And I, and I paid more for that one pan than this whole set. Yes. And this is what I use. I'm, I'm actually, I'm, I don't use those pans. This is all that I use. I think that you'll love them. I, and I think your son will love them. Well, I'm excited for them. Uh, I have a question. Can we use metal or stainless steel on them? You can use metal if you if you want to. It's recommended that you don't. It's recommended that you use something that's plastic. You know, just to you'll protect the coating longer. Yes. Okay. Um, but you can. You can. It's just it's like anything else. You know, you want to take as good of care of them as you can. If you use metal utensils, Lisa, eventually you'll find fine lines. But okay. what you won't have is you won't have the substance that makes up the nonstick, the ceramic coming off into your food. Yeah, okay. you may you may see a scratch eventually, but it's not going to yeah. come off on your food. Okay. Well, I'm I'm excited to get them, and I know my son will. Uh, it'll be a lot easier for him to clean too. Absolutely. Yeah, and tell him wow. he just throws them in the dishwasher, <laughs> or if he doesn't have a dishwasher, he just wipes them out with a wet rag, and he's good. I mean, Trisha, yeah, you gotta I'm show him what you're doing. Them. I know. I'm just. See, I'm, I'm, know, I'm fascinated know, by the swirling. I don't even egg. know if Trisha eats <laughs> eggs or she just. Cooks them to play I don't, with I them just, in the pan. I just play them with the pan. I mean, <laughs> you don't have to put anything in this pan. You don't have to put oil or butter. I would use a little bit of butter just for flavor, but just a tiny bit. I, I, I would use a lot of. And I, you would use a lot of butter. Flavor. I understand. But I mean, that yeah. you don't. It doesn't get. I'm gonna. I'm gonna pour this out on the plate. It doesn't get any easier than that, right there. Perfect. Well, I'm very excited, and Trisha, I have to say that I'm going to be seeing you March 28th in Arco Arena. Oh, yay! Can't wait to see you and your husband. Well, we will be there. We're looking forward to it. Great. Beautiful. Well, thank you so much, and I can't wait to get this. Enjoy. Thank, thank you, you, Lisa. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, I'm going to go back to vegetables, even though I know that's not your thing. Um, no, no, I don't, no, okay, I don't hate vegetables. I just pretend to. Well, this is the steamer basket I that like you talked about. Basket What's also cool lot. about this is that if you're not, let's see how hot this is. If you're not using it, uh, you can also just you can take the steamer basket out, and then you've still got you've got this okay. great three quart pan to cook in, which is which is awesome. But I also use this as a strainer. If I'm cooking pasta, okay. I'll use it as a colander. So uh, it's kind of double use. This. Now again, it is oven safe up to 350 degrees. Yes. Uh, you put a steak in the oven. I did. And I had never thought about doing this. She, she had, and it's a big thick steak. 
a little bit of red sauce, a little, little cheese, cheese on top. And voila. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, that's hot because it's it just came warm. out of the oven. But look at this. Look at look that. Look at this. Now I'm going to pour this up. Now see, okay, Carefully. let me explain something. That's the Easily. meal that I expect Garth Brooks to come home and ask for. <laughs> Not the kale soup, but I will try your kale soup. You keep That's saying that. That's fabulous. Now check this pan out. I know I keep going back to the easy cleanup. And that was cleanup, filled with cheese. And look at the cleanup on this. Filled with cheese. And it's not cheese. just about the cleanup. It's how evenly it cooks, how quickly it cooks. You can sear in it. Right. Your food tastes better when it's cooked in the right implements. These are tools to make your, half, your family smile. Exactly. And this pan, it has grill marks on the bottom, but you don't have to just grill or sear in it. Okay. I make eggs in this. I make bacon in it because the because it they kind of sit it kind of sits on top of these these grill marks. So the grease kind of drains. So the grease kind of drains okay. underneath. Um, anything you want to, you can cook in it. Uh, we'll go off our phone lines again here in just a second. I'm going for it. I'm going to do you it. You are. You're going for I'm it. I'm doing it. I trust you. You do. I'm, I'm proud Here's of you. Here's the deal. Anybody who cooks things like apple pie. I see you working around the kale there. You I don't got a little have to. bit. There's some green in there, isn't there? Is there a little bit of green There's in there? There's a little bit of green in there. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, wait. I don't have a spoon. Oh, oh, oh. they're getting me a spoon. They're getting me a spoon. Do you have one particular favorite feature about this cookware? Because um, it's revolution. They have the patent on the ceramic coating. Yeah. Everybody and their kid brother, any brand name that you know of in the world of cookware is looking into ceramics, but they can't do it this way. You'll see this when you, that was hot. When You'll see this when you use this for the first time, the, the how it feels in the pan. When you just, even when you put a little pat of butter in it, you'll yep. just see it doesn't just all go to one side. It evenly distributes, and they're so smooth. They're so easy to clean out. Uh, we should oh, bring in thank you. Spoon. Here's the here's the here's the fun test. This is um, what they what you guys here call the um, uh, what do you call it? Well, it's like the release. You know, but it's like a you call it some kind of test where it's like hey, what's the worst thing we can do? To this we pan? throw the gooeyest things in the yeah, world so into you, a pan. So, so this pan has cheese, it has marshmallows and chocolate, um, and which what, strangely enough is what I had for breakfast. <laughs> I want to put as much heat on this as I can. Okay. And I'm going to let it get really gross. And then I'm going to show you how easy the, clean, the pan cleans out. All right, I'm, I'm going to try this. Okay. You, you've never lied to me before, so yeah, I'm get, trusting. Get a little piece of that chorizo, you'll be happy. Little, get a little ham in there along yeah. with my kale. <laughs> and this is this is your kale soup. Kale soup. Yeah, you guys call this the torture test. This means that you can't. I really didn't want to like this. <laughs> but that's really, really good. you got to trust me, Dan. That is really good. Well, thank you. I forgot what I was going to say. I've got everything cooking on here. I'm just watching this, this learning this stovetop. And this also, we're using a Patricia, gas cooktop, but you can use this on electric. It's not, it doesn't have any rules how there. How about the new convection stovetops? Can you use it on um, that? I, I'm, I think so. I think you can use it on any, anything. Okay. I, just, I think so. Anything, any regular cooktop. But this is, this is your playground. Yeah. Your sixth is, season with your show. And again, your show is called? My show's called Trisha's Southern Kitchen. Beautiful. Ooh, they're showing the, the cobalt blue on camera right now. It's so pretty. Mm, by the way, I was just informed, these were not designed for induction cooking. Okay, so you're talking Bring fancy for top. me. I'm like, I don't know. I'm not <laughs> sure exactly what you're... I have a gas cooktop stove, but I had electric before that. My sister has electric. She uses these pans. Um, hi, Beth. She's there somewhere. Yeah, I need help. Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> Thank you, Scott. Let me run through the colors. You know what? Look at this. I'm going for my second piece of kale. I'm just trying to, I, I don't, I know, I can't get the flame to, there you go. Mm -mm -mm. The colors, we've never seen this many colors Thank you. from the folks at Green Pan. And we've got colors that are not even available in the general marketplace. The purple, that eggplant is exclusive to QVC and will be for a while. That is the most limited color. You're getting a big set here. That's a big 11 pieces. Here's the green, that green is exclusive to QVC. This, that's the blue. We have black, and then we have a really pretty burgundy red. And the burgundy red has been exceedingly popular so far. And then, don't forget the turquoise. That was really good. Thank you. Here's what you're going to get. You're going to get a big 7-inch skillet. You're also going to get the 11-inch the skillet. So those are those groove marks that we were showing you earlier. That's what allows you to sear. You're then going to get a 4-quart covered saucepan. You're going to get a 1-quart covered saucepan. The three quart also comes with your steamer insert, which is a really hard piece to find. We include it. We then also give you 
the great big six quart Dutch oven. That's everything you would need in a cooker set at a remarkable price. And by the way, this set was brought to QVC and QVC alone. You yes. won't find this from the folks at Green Pan out in the marketplace. Now, right. you, that looks like you made a mess, but that's going to be easy to clean. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be easy to clean. This is called the torture test. It looks like a s'more gone bad is what it looks like. <laughs> I'm going to get it out of the pan, and then, again, it's like all that chocolate, it's cheese, it's marshmallows cooked to the bottom of the pan, and it's going to wipe right out. Trisha, the best to you. Best your husband, you Garth Brooks, your show, your tour. You're coming back at, what, 10 a.m.? I am. With Mary Beth. Uh, you're, you're just a joy to work with. Thank you. Thank you so very, I'll very much. I'll just be cleaning some pans. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Trisha, you're welcome.